Well, I lied once again, folks. It's midnight, but I noticed that if I click on the alleyway at night, in the meanwhile, somewhere seedy enough, I've got enough energy in me to definitely do one more of these episodes. This is definitely going to be a new event. Oh, don't give me that look, young lady. You owe me, and you know it. <laughs> oh my god, I saw the new Neo Sprite, the Pouty Neo, and like, damn, look at Torchwick. Like, in the list of hot characters, it's like, Torchwick, Adam, Crow, and then Cinder. Like, fucking look at him. Holy shit. I helped you salv salvage your one and only friendship, didn't I? No, I really doubt that you could have done it on your own. Your solution was to let it out on our business partners. So, you're going to help me solve this little mess with our supply line, and that's final. <laughs> That's better. Now, do you remember the plan? No witnesses, and that means do it when no one's looking. We do not need a trail of bodies. Very well. And do you remember the specifics for a good bait? Oh my god, look at her. She's so cute. Oh, wow, that's perfect. He'll fall for it. Hook, line, and sinker. Great job. You sure you haven't done this before? What day is it? Doesn't matter. Alright, dorm. Don't want to be a bother. Amphitheater is training. Library. Never mind. Um, uh, mess hall? Nope. Yale City, Alley, Main Street. Oh, that's for... That's for the Glinda Goodwitch event, I think. But whatever. Hmm. Alright. Looks like... Alright, now if we had Dormitory. No. Fail City. Alley. This is... That could be the Malachite event? Yeah. Classroom. Classroom. Fail City. Alley. Nah. Main Street. Nah. Okay, that means I think I have everything I need for the Neo event, right? Class, class, gym, time to get some training in, strength, class, class, gym, time to get some more training in, strength. Hmm, time for some pantry restocking. Yeah, that's a Neo event, no doubt in my mind. Girls, I'm going to Vale to stock up on food. Oh, Wilson, wait. Let me join you. We will be able to carry a superior amount of food back to the school. Huh? Um, sure, but don't you have your, ch your checkup to go to? Today it was done earlier, while you were asleep. The operator had to run standard maintenance on the machinery during the day. Oh, well, I definitely don't mind some company. Let's go. <laughs> Let's. That's 81% of the list. And you're carrying most of it yourself. I mean, I know she's super strong, but... Um, right, so next we have to go grab paper towels and napkins. The shop should be right around. Huh? What just happened? Penny, is there something wrong? Why did you suddenly fall sigh? Sorry, Wilson, but I've just identified a priority target. A uh, target? Oh shit. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Roman Torchwick, you dastardly dapper evil. We meet again. Who in the actual... The Laser Ginger? What's this, a nickname contest? Penny, who's this person? Also, we can interact with Roman Torchwick. Roman Torchwick, crime boss, scoundrel extraordinaire, and one of Ruby Rose's nemesis. Why are you talking like a pulp comic book? I call them as I see them. Criminal scum, what are you up to? Nothing, and if you could please shut your trap, I'd be terribly grateful. Hey, don't you talk to Penny like that. Ugh, a new kid, what's your deal? Diamond nails, ear-shattering vocals, sentient fungal growths? Stop me if I get it right. 
You shall never even lay eyes on Wilson's semblance, for I shall apprehend you myself today. All right, girl, seriously, I'm in the middle of something right now. Nah. So you are up to no good. Just you shall not wait. Aw, oh, come on. Shit, if this keeps up any longer. Um, Penny, don't you want to at least put down... <laughs> Our groceries? Best event. 10 out of 10. 11 out of 11. Game of the year. Every year. Huh, never seen her act like a go-getter before. Wonder what the story behind it. If it involves Ruby... Yeah, the fight at the docks was... The end of volume one, all of Tumblr was just one text post that said, holy shit, Penny, with like 60,000 notes. It was just like, yep, you reblogged, holy shit, Penny. I reblogged, holy shit, Penny. My sister reblogged, holy shit, Penny. Who the fuck didn't reblog, holy shit, Penny? Oh, look, a picture. All right, now 300 more posts of holy shit, Penny. She said he's a crime boss, huh? But what would a crime boss be doing just standing around in the middle of the streets if he was waiting for something or someone? In fact, wasn't he staring at to Rick? Huh, alright, you cute. It's fine, I understand what you mean. Hmm? I guess word was bound to spread sooner or later. Don't worry, daddy will treat you right. That girl doesn't look like she's into her partner as much as he is. That torture guy was looking right at the building they just came out of. Wait, could it be? Maybe I'm overthinking it. He's just... Neo's gonna look at him and he's just gonna go, Oh, hi, Neo. Alright, that's definitely an expression of surprise and I don't know that girl from anywhere. So it's only because I'm not the person who's supposed to be standing here. What's wrong? Come now. Okay, that settles it. Look at Neo, look at Neo. Um, excuse me, sir, you dropped this. Huh? What's your damage, pwn? Ow, my eyes! This way, hurry! Sweet merciful god, the yoke! The yoke is in my eyes! Dude, you should worry about the shell. Impossible! How could he escape? Because he's Torchwick. I'm murdering my self-esteem and putting my personal hygiene second. He's hiding in a dumpster. Also, cool interesting fact about Roman. Actually, my favorite fact about Roman and what solidifies him as one of the best villains in the series. I'm sorry, the best villain in the series. He never unlocked his semblance. Never ever. Never figured out what it was and just didn't let it stop him. Kicked ass. I wanted to see Ruby's face when I delivered his unconscious form in front of her door. What am I, a trophy? Oh god, this family's eating way too many greens. Oh well, I guess I better go find Wilson and return to our schedule. Oh, and I just had to, and I just dry cleaned this coat. Fun fact, I actually plan on cosplaying him at RTX this year if I go. And if not, then next year. Oh, what a bust of a day. Let's hope at least Neo didn't go off the rails. <clears throat> Ugh, so many guys skulking around. Yeah, definitely a mob boss. And, they ev and they're even cutting off our route to the police station. Clever dicks. I mean, I'm fairly certain I could power through them if need be, but I'm afraid she could get hurt. She's so shaken, from, so shaken from what happened that she hasn't even talked yet. Look at her, she's whimpering. I mean, considering we have to stay silent to hide, or, or, hide, it works in our favor, but still. Oh, what was that Torchwick guy thinking involving some, someone like her in? I bet she was just some kind of bait. I have to wait this out. <laughs> we stay out of sight until they move and go block by block. Look at her smile, look at her smile. Look at her laughing. Why isn't Wilson answering his phone? I'm starting to get worried. I shouldn't have ran off like that. Wilson is getting stronger. Yes, but still. I should ask around. Um, excuse me, sir. Oh, and what do you want? Sorry to bother you, but I was wondering if you'd seen a boy around my age with blonde hair and a white jacket? With red trims and black leather arm gloves? Oh, indeed. He's a student from Beacon. Have you seen him? You his friend? Yes, but we've gotten separated. Can you tell me where you've seen him last? Oh, I'll do you one better. Let me help you find him. 
You would? Thank you, good sir. Under that seedy appearance and the scented, egg scented aftershave lies a good soul. Oh, mother. <laughs> Huh, that was sudden. They all suddenly up and left. Maybe the guy got tired or something, came up on their end. Oh well, lucky me. This way the way to the police station is now clear. Come on, we're safe now. Here we are. Now would be a good time to let Penny know where I am. I had to turn my phone to silent earlier while I was hiding. I hope she didn't get too worried. Oof, look at all those missed calls, and she's calling me right now. Sorry, I have to take this. Just one second. Penny, I'm so sorry I... We have the red-haired girl. Who is this? Who do you think, punk? I'll make you regret the day you egged me. Wait, you're the guy from before? You captured Penny. What, don't believe me? Say hi, girl. Hi, Wilson. Oh, fine. What do you want? We're gonna send you a location. Come along, bring the girl you snatched, and none of your fancy aura tricks, Mr. Beacon student. Um, wouldn't it make more sense to just have him tell us where he is so I can go to him? The Emerald Forest is a terrible place for a meeting, even on the outskirts. Girl, I'm the expert here. A place for an exchange has to be hidden and creepy. Let me do my job. Oh, okay, Mr. Egg. See you there, Wilson. Who the hell's Mr. Egg? Oh, I just wanted to go out for groceries. Listen, I have to go deal with those guys. Go to the police, they'll be able to help you. Nice meeting you, and, um, good luck. Sue and Mobster, silly Penny. Let's hope the groceries are safe. Thank gods we didn't get anything that was supposed to be fridged before she ran off after that Torchwick guy. <laughs> Look at Pouty Neo. I love Neo. I love Neo so much. So, I don't think it's a good long-term form of employment. You should start looking into something that allows you to make actual, legal, non-suspicious savings. Yeah, I think about quitting a lot, but it's more about the style than the money, you know? You fall into habits and... For the last time, stop getting friendly with the Huss. You did not just name me Mr. Egg, you Italian bastard. Oh... Come on, Minos. You gotta break the fourth wall now of all times. Look, I was getting tired of seeing a bunch of X's and the name just fit, you know? I'll fit my fist right up to your, your skull if you don't. Oh, Wilson's here. You heard her. Wilson's here. Oh, this is not over. Considering I know what happens next, this is so over. I guess Neo's a good character to break the fourth wall with, seeing as she can't speak. I'm here. Finally. Hi, Wilson. I have you right where I want you now. Stay where you are or... Wait a minute. Where's my girl? Police station. The fuck? I told you to bring her along. He did. Wilson, that's not very nice. He's worried about his friend, too. Oh, Penny, this guy is a perv. I got that girl away from him. Oh, I see. Oh, whatever. I can track her down later. Now surrender, boy. Yeah, how about no? Don't you care what happens to her? Wow, man, come on. She's such a nice girl and she's your friend. That's cold. Oh, thanks, Mr. Thug, sir. Oh, I'm so tired. Listen, Mr. Egg. I'm not fucking Mr. Egg. Before asking a student from Beacon to come to a secluded place for a host exchange, did you bother asking Penny where I know her from? I'm from his team. Uh, yeah, so we're going home now, and you should probably turn yourself in or some. What the? Oh my. The girl? Okay, now I'm confused. How? What are you doing here? It's too dangerous to... Ne... Neo? Neopolitan? Oh, no, 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 no. I, 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 it was you all along? It's been a long time. Well, actually, we were never really introduced. I'm Penny. Shit, 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 shit. Torchwick noticed. Torchwick noticed. How? Why? What in the actual? 
Wait, Torchwick is the guy you got the information about Wesser from, isn't he? He's your boss! You gotta go. Right now. Aw, oh, but I wanted to exchange contacts with Penny. Of all the- Why did you fake the whole thing? What do you mean there's something more important to talk about? I... I ditched you at the police station because I thought you were a meek, soft, scared girl. But there's nothing meek or soft about you, is there? <clears throat> that wasn't supposed to be a compliment. Hey, red eyes. Goodness, you can carry out a full conversation with her through body language alone. You've become such good friends in such short time, haven't you? No, we haven't. Uh, Mr. Hunter, sir? And what are you still doing here? Wilson, that's not very nice. They're good people. Huh? But, never mind that. We have a... The fuck? Small problem. That came through really fucked up in my headphones. I don't know how it sounded for you, but for me, that was like... Inhuman screeching. Not like a Beowulf roar. Like, technological... Hmm, we're throwing around a lot of ne we're throwing around a lot of negativity, I guess. Typical. And why am I not surprised you're looking forward to this? I don't want to die. No such risk, Wilson. I will be on defensive duty for our RLS guests. Could I ask you and Neo to be on the front line? Oh, fine. Come along, you pest. Just so you know, I'm still peeved. Would it have killed you just to ask me to spend time together like a normal person would? More fun for you, maybe. Okay, maybe I'm also angry that I couldn't see it until you revealed it. That, if that's your semblance, that's seriously unfair. Oh, yes. That's gonna be my new background wallpaper. Shit, yeah, boy. Today's been totally crazy, but I guess I should expect that by now when you're involved. Look at the way Neil sort of bites her lip. Look at the little glint of red in her eyes. Anyway, more about that later. Don't you dare hold back now. Yep. That roar is all sorts of fucked up for me. Oh, oh shit. Shit, that kid actually saved my life, didn't he? If Neapolitan was after me, it means Torchwick knows I've been selling some of the supplies. I've gotta to skip town, grab my shit and never... Boom. Melodic cudgel to the chest. Oh, if you want something done well, etc. God, I love him. Thanks, Penny. We'll be in touch. Be safe, everyone. Have a pleasant tomorrow. Can't believe we're just letting them go. I'm positive that after tonight, they're going to turn their lives around. I guess a close encounter with both Neo and a bunch of Grimm in the same evening will make you rethink your choices, huh? Speaking of which, I figured she was strong, but gods. And what exactly is the deal with her semblance? I couldn't follow her movements at all. I'll go reserve the seats for the last bullhead before they close for the night. Thanks for your help, Neapolitan. Good night. Yeah, she's a nice, gentle girl. Total opposite of someone else. Yeah, I know. Just because you like it doesn't mean it's your thing. And speaking of which, I don't think you should do that kind of stuff anymore. I know that you were really never in any kind of danger, but, you know, for all your issues, you're still a girl. I don't like thinking of you doing stuff like that. Oh, that's so patronizing, isn't it? What I mean to say is, for what it's worth, I'm glad you're safe. I guess of all people, Jacobigus would have an issue of. Yeah, yeah, after what happened with Bella. Yeah. I have to go now. Good night, Neo. Oh, look at her. You're now close with Neopolitan. But um but a da dum and now I think I've done everything in this build. If not, we'll see it next time. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Have a good day.